girls have evolved into um, what we call our little divas. <laughs> um, they, they know that the hair has to be hair uh, braided and curled, and they have to go to school with it. And um, some of them are quite excited when they hear that we have a performance on a Friday because they know that the hair has to be braided and curled on Thursday. And so they get to wear their curls to school on Friday and everybody gets to ask, what are you doing? And these girls are also pros at makeup already. Um, we put makeup on the little girls just a little. And when it comes time for the lip gloss, one of the girls grabbed the, the, the little lip gloss thing and she went, is this MAC? Okay, <laughs> for any of you guys who don't know, we only wear MAC makeup on our, our babies. On everybody in the halal. And for a four, five-year-old girl to go, is this Mac? Okay, I was cracking up. Cracking up means laughing a lot. I was laughing a lot backstage. Just these kids, they're just, they, they don't miss a beat at all, let me tell you. But with Kona Kayapua, the song that they just did with the Kalao is a very traditional Hawaiian song about Kona. It speaks of the clouds, the billowing clouds above the ocean. And it's a song written for Liho Liho. So I, took, I asked the kids if they, when they looked up into the sky, they could see anything in the clouds and they were looking at, there's a couple of them said yes, but I would say about 90% of them looked at me like I was crazy. So I said, okay, we're going on a field trip. So we took them to the cliffs at the Sheraton where all you can see is the beautiful horizon and the ocean and the clouds. And so I made them all lie on the grass and they're like, uncle, what are we doing? I said, okay, look into the clouds. Tell me what you see. Clouds. <laughs> no, no, tell me what you see inside. See, I see a rabbit. Uncle, those are clouds. <laughs> I said, no, look, you can see something inside. Look, look real good. And I said, there, there, there's a hippo. And the girls looked at me and they went, Uncle, those are clouds. <laughs> so it took about three times we actually went to the cliffs till the kids finally started to see things inside of the clouds. And that's where their true imagination comes from. And I told them to stop playing their video games and to go and sit in the grass and look at the clouds so that they can see more things in the clouds. This next song is entitled Ke Aonani, written by Mary Kamena Pukui. It's the first hula kahiko that all of our keiki and our halau learn. Ke Aonani is a simple song that speaks of placement in life, where the birds belong flying in the sky and the fish belong swimming in the ocean, and the plants belong growing upright in the forest and the flowers bloom. What a beautiful world. The song is entitled Ke Ao Nani. Iluna. Iluna la iluna Namanu o kaleva Iluna la iluna Namanu o kaleva Ilalo Ilalo la ilalo Napua o kamudua Ilalo la ilalo Napua o kamudua Iuka Iuka la iuka Na ulu la hau Iuka la iuka Na ulu la hau Ikai Ikai la ikai la Na ia o kamuana Ikai la ikai la Na ia o kamuana Haina Haina mai kamuana Ahena nike aunei Haina mai kamuana Ahena nike aunei Yala 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 Okay. 
right, smile <laughs> and wave, and you can go back to the dressing room. <laughs>